Hello, Mario. Basic 2D CAD. Tabs. All right, hello, let's have a look at tabs. Well, first of all, what are tabs? Well, these are the tabs down here. So this here, the first tab is right down here in the bottom uh, left. The first tab is the model tab. So that's where we have our model space. Now in model space, that is the real world. Everything is one to one in model space. So that is where we map the world at its true dimension. However, we have these various layouts here, which um, enable us to look at uh, model space in various ways. So uh, to look at model space, as you can see in this tab here, it's opened up in what we call paper space. So that's just like looking at a piece of paper. However, to look into model space, we need to have a viewport. So if I just click on here, you'll see this is a viewport. And um, then we can go into model space. And then in the viewport, we can look through into, um, into model space through paper space. So that becomes our plan. And then we can scale uh, model space in here to scales that suit our requirements. So model space is always one to one. So let I'll just say for instance here, just go C for circle. I'm drawing a circle here like so. And if I go now go into model space, you can see that the circle is there. And then in the tab here, um, you can see that there's the circle there. However, if I, um, well, I'll, I'll go change this to paper space and I'll draw another circle, see here. And this is, I'm just drawing on the bit of, I'm just drawing here on the bit of paper. Even though I'm still in the viewport, this has been drawn on the piece of paper. And if I go to model space, you'll see that it's not there because it's drawn on in paper space, not model space. So, um, you know, there's a lot of different things that uh, happen in these tabs and they're very useful. Now, the tabs are obviously how I use them quite a lot is the tabs along here um, will be the, um, the sheets of my plan. So I might um, rename this tab I might name this sheet one so they the straight away you can see that they can be sheet one like so and this here could be sheet two uh, rename sheet two um, oh, well sheet uh, oops S H E E T sheet 2. So, so um, there's lots of functionality in there. Now, um, in here also, um, if we right click on the tab, there's quite a few things like with regards to layouts and templates, delete, rename, move or copy. Uh, and we can have the page set up mounted, which enables us to um, like set it up and how we want it so we can uh, identify the printer that we're going to use and I um, usually um, just have it set to the um, Adobe PDF printer but um, not everybody has that one so um, perhaps the uh, Windows default um, the window default Windows system printer or something like that um, is an option so then you can set the size of your um, your um, plan you might want to set it as at an A2 perhaps um, and then how you plot it scales that you plot it at la portrait or landscape here um, your plot uh, style table can go up in here that's a whole new a whole uh, a whole half hour of video on itself but there's lots of uh, functionality in through here so I'm just going to go with that there at the moment uh, in there and you can see so that's this is this here is uh, this here is the um, extent of the printer and uh, this is a viewport that um, be put in there but it's 
was drawn small and then we can go to model space here and we could make this viewport bigger which the viewport is a window into uh, into our model space now one of the other things that um, is quite helpful okay is um, we can um, import uh, various layouts or plan forms into here so we can go for instance from template here and uh, you'll see this one here now I've got a uh, oh um, basic 2d CAD video 2d land so there's my template a template that I've created there at some point so I can there and there's a picture of it there so I can click like that and uh, I want the a2 landscape version um, and it'll import itself into my job and uh, there it is there there's my little um, my little template so that could be the template that I'm going to be using for this job and um, obviously I might have a viewport in there um, and I can go um, into here uh, or zoom uh, extents I haven't got anything drawn in uh, I must have deleted that stuff in model space there uh, it looks like I have okay so um, you know we can use that for um, putting our creating our plans um, so I might uh, again I might call that one let's say rename that um, sheet I'll call that one sh sheet three sheet three so that'll there and then I might want to say uh, move or copy so I can uh, move to the end and I can create a copy and that'll create a copy of that sheet there um, which I could rename uh, sheet four um, like so and uh, as you can see then you can you can set up all of the sheets of a plan all looking into uh, different parts of model space so um, yeah there's lots of functionality there within the uh, in the tabs there um, and you can see there's there's a lot of things here that I uh, actually haven't uh, used at all myself um, but um, you know they, they are functionality that's there but I think um, I've covered the general functionality of tabs and what I mostly use it for so just to recap on that um, mostly I use it for setting up the page and getting the, the plan set up so that we can print them out uh, and then we can move or copy name and rename delete um, we can create new layouts and what have you so generally that's what um, they're the most um, things that I use the tabs for there are other things that they can be used for clearly um, but um, I think that will cover well certainly for me anyway 90% of um, what I use them for so let's uh, let's stop there and um, yeah cheers see you